let's start by learning about our students starting their journey. Each has boarded the Ventura College success ship and are ready to learn. Our new students' success can be enhanced by our actions, process, and how we interact with these students. We can create a community for them with tailored supports that respond to their needs and a community that celebrates their successes. Such a community can help them stay on their academic paths so that they can reach their life's goals. Meet Samantha, Tomas, Juan, Maria, Andre, and Corey. Samantha has decided she wants to teach young children, but she doesn't know what grade she wants to teach yet. Her counselor suggested she start exploring in the field of child development. The counselor rounded out her schedule with English and math. Samantha is trying to balance going to school while she raises her little one with limited help from her parents. Tomas is good with numbers and grew up helping his family balance the books of their small family business. He's interested in accounting so he can even be more knowledgeable and helpful to his family. He's trying to figure out how will he complete school in two years while also working more than 40 hours per week to support himself and his family at their small business. Juan is an English major. He works at Prospects Coffee Shop and he's always been a reader. He loves a variety of literature and is passionate as a creative writer. He doesn't have too many close friends and does not socialize a lot. School and the coffee shop are the only times that he truly interacts with people when he chooses to. Juan has had some issues some days with getting food he needs and is looking for steady housing. Currently, he is couch surfing at his buddy's place and he's concerned with all the places where he's been staying that he may have been exposed to COVID at some point. Maria is a student studying to be a biologist. She has already taken a couple of courses at VC while she was in high school. Maria is highly focused on getting through school so she can move on to a university. She has taken 18 units this semester and would like to get an internship if possible. However, due to the pandemic, she wonders if she will be able to have outside experiences that UCs like transfer students to have had prior to applying. After seeing how wonderfully the nurses treated his grandfather during the final years of his life, Andre chose nursing as his life's professional pass. He is an English language learner and is worried he won't be able to understand all the information shared in classes and that he will fall behind in his work. Corey is a first year student not quite sure of his options and what he wants to study. He has felt pressure to enroll in college as his parents are urging him along because they would really like for him to be a lawyer or a medical doctor. Corey doesn't think he would enjoy being in the sciences and he doesn't know what he needs to major in to become a lawyer. He was an outstanding musician in high school, writing songs, playing trombone in the high school band and coaching middle school band students. His parents, however, think that music should be nothing more than a hobby. To add to all of this, his best friend is currently working in construction, making $20 per hour, and that looks pretty good to Corey as well. Our students are starting their journey. Each student is coming from challenges that can be big barriers to their success, and we have the opportunity to support them on their pathway. Join us as we work together to build a community of support for each and every student.